Hello Tally Hoes, welcome back to my channel. This is my first sit down video since my surgery, so I'm super excited to be sat here chatting with you. I'm gonna be showing you so much shit that I've been buying recently. Most of it is actually home stuff, so haven't even got a place to move out to yet. Still, we're still in the process been looking for about a million years now um but soon come hopefully pray for me and all that so i'm actually going to start with like super random bits and bobs which is on this side of the room because honestly i'm like sat in a field of stuff right now and i decided to film somewhere that i mean i do technically film here because it's just zoomed out and i'm higher up sat on a chair but we're sat on the floor because i kind of wanted this to feel like a little bit of a vlog type of thing, you know? Because I also want to chat to you, like catch up with you guys, have a bit of a chin wag. Although my brother and his kids will be home soon and then you might hear screaming kids. So technically I am actually on a time scale here. So the first things that I'm gonna show you guys, you've probably seen it already on some of my vlogs because I've been wearing them non-stop. Although they did give me a blister, it started bleeding through my sock and onto these shoes. Yeah. But it's these like fake looking Yeezys from Ego. I saw it on Instagram and I thought, oh my God, I have to. I've wanted some of these for ages. I've got them dirty already, yay. And I think they were 25 pounds. Uh, they're just like fake Yeezys, basically. Super comfortable, apart from the blister situation. But apart from that, you know. Because I loved them so much, I also got them in this colour, brand new, haven't worn them yet. Oh my God, when they're fresh, they're just so amazing. So yeah, I had to get them in two colours. I felt like once they were gone, they were gone. And I live in slides, so yeah. Some of this is also PR. I also got a little PR package from Bondi Sands. Very, very happy about this because I was running out of my SPF face, facial, face moisturizer. The one I had before, I'll link down below. I still loved it. At the moment, I'm using a Dermalogica one that I don't love too much. It kind of makes you feel like you're wearing sun cream. I don't really like that feel. I got sent the hydrating SPF 50 moisturizer. I always get a 50 factor moisturizer and I'm running out of the Dermalogica one. So I'm really happy to try this. And it's from Bondi Sins, mate. And then I got a brightening eye cream and then they sent me also a really cool headband that says everyday skincare. And do you know what I've come to realize, Tally Hose, is that actually these head, whatever they're called, is that the ones like this are easier to use where you can actually take it apart and then put it on without, you know, messing up your hair or whatever. Just much easier to use. Figured that out today actually because um, normally I have the one that you have to like put over your head and then you have to swoop it back. It's actually just easier when it breaks apart basically. So let's open up this moisturizer together. Oh, I love the packaging. How cute is that? And I love pastels, you guys know this. I'm gonna open it because it's summer and anyone else can't open things with their fingers. It has to be their mouth. Look, I got makeup on it. Oh, this is tinted. Is that tinted or is that just me? That's defo tinted, isn't it? Oh my God doesn't have a scent at all. Oh, but that's given me such a nice glow. It does feel quite thick, but I'm gonna let that soak into my hand a little bit and then I'll come back to you on that. And then there's no point showing you the eye cream. So yeah, I got those. Then I got some bio oil from Amazon because uh, as you know, I'm, I've got scars on my belly from my surgery and I really don't want them to be very prominent. Of course, if I can help it by by oiling myself up. See what I did there? Then I'll be a very, very happy gal. So got that. Then tally hose. Look at this plastic bag. I went to a car boot sale with my family and I just got these little pots. I really don't want to take it out of this bag, but I want to show you, so. So I got eight of, oh no, she's like proper close the bag up. I'm not going to be able to put this back in the bag. 
Okay, here we go. So I got eight of these glass bowls. For my flat one day, I was thinking like they could just be like peanuts for guests, you know, when you're having like a little tray of stuff. Um, that sun cream feels really nice, by the way. And also this is kind of the portion size that I can actually eat. So if I want to be bougie and eat out of a glass bowl, then I'm going to do that. So definitely go to charity shops. This, charity shops? Oh, well go to charity shops. I also got a puzzle from a charity shop the other day as well. But definitely get to some car boot sales if you're like moving out, they've got such good furniture and stuff. And you can always get yourself a bargain, like eight pound for all of those that, no, sorry. Two pound for all of those for eight bowls. I think that's really good. So next up, I went shopping in Audi and you know you can always get some amazing things in Audi. You guys also know that I'm 5'2 and struggle to wear majority of trousers that I get. So I decided that I'm gonna teach myself uh, how, no wait how to sew. So I got this sewing kit. It is apparently for like beginners, which is perfect because obviously I am a beginner. I need it to be super simple. It's got 12 built in stitch patterns. It's got like a foot pedal. It's in white. Yeah. And I just feel like I'm going to learn how to hem all my own trousers. And this was 30 quid from Audi. Is that not a bargain? So moving on, we are going to look at some of PLT's homeware again, because I'm obsessed. If you guys want to see more home hauls, then I'll leave the PLT one that I did not too long ago down below. I got some absolute gems and I think most of them are still online. So I'll leave that link down below, but I went a bit crazy. And I got some absolute bangers from PLT. So we're gonna dive straight into it. First, I got these three storage containers with these wooden lids and it's like suctioned, right? So it won't just come off. I absolutely love these. I don't know what I'm gonna use it for yet. We'll figure it out. But I love the size. I just love them. I think they're amazing. I think I'm going for that type of like, I don't really know how to describe my sort of style, but I love that like black modern look with a bit of funk to it so a bit of pink and also like a tiny bit of wood and that's weird for me to say because I was so against wood for a very long time but I've just fallen in love with like this is a whole new set by the way this so that set you get three this set you get three and these ones are all different heights. So I'm thinking with these ones, I'm gonna do tea, coffee, and sugar. So in this one, I'd have like tea bags. This one, I'm gonna have coffee. And then in the little one, which is so cute, I'm gonna have sugar. And I just, I just think that's a really cute modern way to have your teas and coffees without the whole labels. Like it's clear so you can see exactly what's in it. And I just think it's really, um, what's the word called? Appealing on the eye. That's the only way I can describe it right now. Aesthetically pleasing. Moving on. You guys, I feel like you guys are gonna love these glasses. I bet you some of you are even gonna go blah, 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 blah. blah. I bet some of you are even gonna comment that you have them yourself, but it's like these glasses that have like a double view. I'm so bad at explaining things. They're called double walled piebald glasses. You do only get two in a pack, which is a little bit upsetting. Not gonna lie to you. I'd quite like a set of 20 or something, but look at them. Oh, they're actually a lot bigger because I haven't taken this out of the box yet. They're a lot bigger than I thought they were going to be. But can you see how it's like double lined, double walled even? Let's use the appropriate English here, Sally. I do think that they're plastic. They're not glass, which is kind of good because they look like glass. But if you drop it, you know, it's not going to damage it too much. It says ideal for serving iced tea. So like big iced drinks. 
they're so pretty and I'm actually really really happy that it is plastic oh no sorry it's a borosilicate boral borosilicate silicate glass so moving on <laughs> they also have these small ones for hot drinks ow borosilicate glass two tumblers so these you can serve hot chocolate tea coffee like i'm obsessed with these i feel like i want to put my mouth on it to see what it would be like to actually drink from it because it is quite like a thick band around here but how cute are these honestly my flat when i one day move out is gonna be my haven it's just gonna be amazing and i'm so excited i would quite like at least another set of both of these glasses just to have four because if you have a guest of four then you want them all to be drinking out the same glass you know but i had to get these they were so so cute so moving on with the same type of feel i saw this glass teapot and i had to oh she's gorgeous she's so cute so you can put your tea in the middle bit let it brew right there in the hot water mate and then put the lid on and look at her sorry i feel like i'm belle from bloody beauty and the beast come round for tea serve tea with your glass teapot and your glass glasses I'm so excited. And look at what, this is like perfection. Is it not? Look. Okay, never mind. you can't really see it. Next, tally hose. This is my favorite thing that I'm showing you today. I'm not gonna lie. Like I'm thoroughly obsessed. So we've got two of these glasses. They're ribbed. It is glass with, oh, So you get two of these glasses and then this vase, vase? Oh my god what do you call this for the life of me i cannot remember but one of these to serve your drinks you know i don't know why but i just love it i just love it i just feel like if you were to have like a bar trolley and you had this with these glasses on it it would just look really really cool you can make like cocktails in here make some squash you can Put some orange juice for like a breakfast when everyone comes around for breakfast not that a lot of people do breakfasty things or brunch so when you've got guests around you're having your brunch you're using all of your glass teapots your glass drink drinkers then of course you're gonna want a mood light speaker this is called the set the mood speaker it's got eight no it's not it's got six led color changing modes it plays for up to three hours and also you can't really go wrong with the aesthetic of this you could have this on a shelf on top of a book or books going that way that would be cute and then it just like holds the books up why has it got this anyway it is wireless it says it's got 10 meters transfer distance i don't know why you'd want to hang it upside down but it also hangs upside down i just think this is really really cute and mood lighting like if it if it goes pink i'm all about that i'm all about it so i wanted to get my hands on this and then just touching on really really quickly in my last plt haul i got one of these pillows so i just wanted to get another one so that i can put them on my bed i got the matching throw last time that's on my other youtube video go check it out um for the bed how cute so the last thing that i got from plt specifically is this pink tower blender you know me i'm a bit of a sucker for pink so when i saw these i was like oh my god i wanted it i also wanted the food processor but it ran out it was out of stock on plt so i did get that separately from amazon i will show you that in a second but yeah this is just like a blender to make smoothies i'm not gonna lie i don't have smoothies a lot so i feel like i probably won't get too much use out of this but also if you're making like hummus 
dips and stuff you can also make it in a, in this type of blender and also they do have a whole set of tower pink like kitchen appliances i was kind of thinking mm, tally calm down don't get any ideas about getting the whole pink set because i feel like you know the microwave things on show i don't want them to be pink i feel like that's a bit much but for all of my actual appliances that actually get stored in the kitchen cupboard i think i'm gonna get them in pink i think i still want this hand blender and then maybe the baking like blender thing the one that's got like that goes like this but at the same time do i bake no will i start to bake no so so like i said i had to get my hands on it i wanted both of them i wanted them to look cute they are on show that they match so i got this food chopper one liter pink glass bowl chopper you guys know me you know i'm not a chef i'm trying to step up my game i'm trying to learn how to cook and i just feel like if i can save myself chopping vegetables for hours before i actually get to the cooking part then i'd love some help <laughs> so that's why i got this of course it's pink it looks amazing and also if you look at the reviews on amazon of these products they're actually really good which is why i had to get this i think this was literally 20 pounds it's so inexpensive and for the v reviews had to i had to talios next we got these three containers from uh, the range i just think for my size portions that i can eat now that these would be the perfect size to pop in my small handbag and take it out for the day put a hard boiled egg in there put some raspberries in there put a baby bell and you're kind of good to go cheap as well 1.99 i think so next i got a little pr delivery for the mouth <laughs> for the teeth so i got an oral care kit which i'm very excited about i just had a hygienist appointment they told me that i have what's it called gum disease so that's fun so i'm actually this is really good timing i'm taking my oral care a little bit more seriously now so i've got this then i got sent a toothpaste charcoal toothpaste for i'm assuming whitening because i'm pretty sure that's what charcoal is for i will use this but i am also going to get like a gum disease prevention toothpaste my cousin sent me one she's obsessed with like teeth care so i'm just going to be following her lead basically and then i got sent this glow 32 whitening system 100 percent going to be using this you guys know that i've been going on about how yellow my teeth look at the moment don't know how to use this but if you guys are interested then when i use it i can vlog it let me know if you want that and then i just got this like bamboo toothbrush as well random but wow that's the end of this video um it was only 29 minutes of filming i feel like it's going to be a short one i feel like we didn't catch up about random things either maybe next time i'll do like a q a version of this or maybe just a q a is it time for a new q a i feel like it could be let me know comment down below again a massive thank you for supporting me for watching me comment down below like if you've got any of these things what you think about this haul all of that kind of stuff i'm gonna do a shout out in this video because i can this video's shout out is to rachel hoy from australia you know i love you guys so much guys anyone who's watching from australia if i come will you show me around <laughs> like please i want to see the crocodiles mate i don't know how you guys live with all of the spiders and snakes because i really hate snakes like genuinely a lot and i know that some of you guys get them in your garden as well anyway i'm going on a date now <laughs> we didn't get interrupted by my niece and nephew either which is great i really hope that you are doing well i love you so so much thank you for watching and i'll see you very soon for my next video Love you.